Hello everyone, we are in the center of Kyiv on Maidan where four years ago started the great conflict between government and people which has its effect on this country and its citizens for now. So we are here to ask people how does conflict affect their lives. Саме непорозуміння сторін і вирішення грошового конфлікту між собою, мабуть, not uh, important for me. Important for Ukraine, not for me. В нас він, так як я з Західної України, він сильно не вплинув, вплинув тільки в плані того, що у нас почали мінятися закони. І все-таки трошки стає після конфлікту, люди групуються. In the United States is very divided. Some people obviously like Donald Trump very much, other people don't like him at all. Personally, I don't like him because I think he's very divisive. I think people need to come together. And I think it's very hard to change somebody's mind. I think maybe just to try to be a good person and do the right thing as far as treating people nice. If you have extra money, try to be generous and help people when you can. Дуже рідко у нашій, принаймні в нашій країні з'являються особи, які можуть вплинути в загальному на цей конфлікт. Все можна вирішити за допомогою мови, аби для цього була, мабуть, бажання. After the survey, we asked Dr. Mamukan Guladze about what is the definition of conflict for him. For me, the conflict is a general term which describes different types of conflict. Cultural conflict, social conflict, and most uh, sensitive and crucial is like military conflict, when two or more than two groups of a people or a state are uh, having dispute on some issue and as they were how is it going to solve this is a military conflict. So that's why it's quite important and you have to be very careful while defining what is your interest. If you think that you have to defend your country, uh, you have to liberate somebody from the threat, facing his life and etc., then somehow the military conflict is justified. But there is a conflict when you're defending your country or you are as an aggressor. So defense is also according to the international law, self-defense, uh, justified measure. But aggression, there is no excuse when you are conducting unjustified measures against other countries. There is also important to mention the role of media in such conflicts. Media plays crucial roles since 20th century. Media became a major source of information, especially traditional media. The new media is uh, gaining support in the society and the reputation is a second major source of information. And that's why media can uh, have a huge impact. Firstly, by putting information on matters of public interest, which is a conflict, but at the same time to provide objective information. As a citizen, as a person, you have to know what is really going on. People can always do something to prevent conflicts, and Mamuka said us his opinion. So democracy is not the best way, best form of countries ruling, but there is no other way. Uh, democracy means you have to engage in discussion and you have to conduct the discussion as much as long as you do not find the solution. That's why there is always a solution or the problem as a way to solve the conflict. But that's why it's important to desire real from all sides to sit at the table and to negotiate this cause. Take into consideration the international standards, um, the basic human rights, and then you can reach, um, uh, can reach your goal, which is solving the problem, solving the conflict.